Pelajari. Oh, so you never know what's behind the gates. That's right. So you open these gates and this is what we come into. Parking for the residents, of course. You know, I have a lot of discussions on my channel about uh, security and fences and stuff. And one of the points I always try to make is that it's not entirely about security, it's about privacy. And if you go to Morocco, and there are big walls and you never know what's behind the wall and the women are veiled. Right. It's not about security, it's about it's none of your business what's behind the wall or it's the not, veil. And it's not only that, the, the more spectacular the wall, the more spectacular the gates, the better off you are, right? So you're showing your promise, you're not showing it by having a fancy car or fancy watch. Look at my big wall. That's Look exactly right. Ones. Yeah, so. Jesus, it's hard to explain that to people. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is beautiful. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. So, in my promise to tell you about some places around Ahihik and the north shore of Lake Chapala, where you might go when you're too old to take care of yourself, <laughs> I'm uh, speaking with Kevin today, who is here and the manager, is that the correct the word? The manager of the moon, right? Manager of the moon. And the moon is a new facility that was built uh, just in the last year. And uh, we're going to have a little tour of it today. So, welcome. Uh, this facility opened in uh, September of 2018, so it is brand new. And so, and we'll go have a look at a few of those and, and show you some of the other um, attractions that we have, such as our gymnasium, pool, all that. So, lead the way. Where are we going, Kevin? Okay, well, we're going to go in number one here. We've got this one furnished, so it gives you an idea. We have 12 of these units. 12. And down at the end, we have three villas. Uh, they're two-bedroom, two-bathroom villas, uh -huh. 1,450 square feet. They're gargantuan. Unfortunately, they're all rented, so I can't show those off right now. Okay. But um, I can definitely show one of these nice one-bedrooms. Come on in. What's this? Is this a solar powered? That's a solar powered light. Cool. With a sensor, so they come on really dim. Yeah. But then as you walk past them, they get brighter. Oh, wow. Look at this. So they do come unfurnished. You know, we could put together a furniture package if somebody wanted. Uh -huh. But what is included are the window blinds, the ceiling fans, fridge and microwave. No stove included because we provide breakfast and dinner. Really? We do. Oh, and they have their own little private patio? Have a little private patio. Nice. All these doors open to provide nice, uh, nice vent ventilation. Uh -huh. So you open it, still have your screen, steel frame, can leave your doors open, no problem. Oh, this is big. This is definitely big enough to have a queen size, or a king size, with a recliner if you like. Nice big closets. And here we put a nice space so you can have a desk and stuff as well. But again, it's unfurnished right. for, the, for the base price, but you can find them some we furniture or make a package. Yeah. Oh, and bathroom, walk-in shower, no steps. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all smooth floor. All smooth floor. So, and what is a one bedroom like this rent for, Kevin? Well, the all-inclusive price, because remember it comes with Breakfast and dinner uh -huh. comes with maid service once a week, laundry service once a week, all your utilities including internet and telephone. Um, we even have US Dish Network, so if you supply the television, we'll hook you up to US Dish Network. Mm -hmm. And everything included is $1,600 a month. And okay. We also have a heated pool, we have a gymnasium, and as I said, all the meals are included, and we can go show you the dining room and the kitchen facilities right now. Let's do that. All right. So that's a mural of this facility. It used to be a warehouse that made clay pottery, decorated clay pottery. There was a restaurant and a furniture warehouse and showroom as well. And it closed 19 years ago. It's called the Billy Moon property. The Billy Moon property. This is exactly. like about one third of the original half of property. It, half, of it. half of it. Right. And that's what it looked like 20 years ago. And then it was abandoned for the past 19 or 18 years. And Jim, Car Jim Clark and Caroline Armstrong bought it and developed this out of it. Wow. All right, so here we have our dining area and kitchen facility. Most people, because of our weather, of course, you know, as everybody knows, as following IDEEC, we have some of the best weather in the world. So most of our meals are actually taken out here. 
Our residents will come out, grab their coffee in the morning, come out, order what they want for breakfast, and then dinner served at six, and they can order what they, um, they have a choice of two proteins. Go look at this, it's not actually a carpet, it's ceramic tile. <laughs> cool. And for those evenings that are chilly or mornings that are chilly, we have an indoor dining room as well. With a fireplace. If needed. Hasn't been needed yet. I've got two of them in my house that have never been used. <laughs> and so just a, a bathroom for the common area here. Mm -hmm. With even fresh linen towels. But what, not hot towels? <laughs> <laughs> that's next year, that's the next project. Okay. <laughs> And here we have our kitchen. This is the kitchen. This is going to be one of the finer kitchens you'll find lakeside. No kidding. This yeah. is a commercial stainless steel kitchen. Yeah. The owners, there's no expense putting this together. Um, it looks brand new. It's been open since September 1st, uh, but we take very good care of it, obviously. And September 1st, if you're watching this video... Oh, 2018, uh, sorry. Two years from now is 2018. So... This is uh, laundry and meat services, works and, out of here. And now you said that laundry service once a week is included? That's right, so we'll come to your unit once a week, clean it, grab your laundry bag, do your laundry, fold it, iron it, have it ready for you in the afternoon with your unit all clean, your bed changed, all ready to go. Now you said that they get one meal a day? Two meals a day. Two meals a day. Breakfast and, and dinner. Breakfast and dinner. Breakfast is served between eight and 10. And dinner served, right now it's served at six, but as we get filled up and more people to serve, we'll probably do two seatings, like a 5.30 and a six o'clock seating. But breakfast and lunch, or breakfast and dinner. Breakfast and dinner. Pool is beautiful. Yeah, and these are the two bedrooms back here, but they're occupied, so That's we're not right. gonna see them? Yeah, they're two bedroom. So are they, are they kind of like the one bedroom, only they got another bedroom that size? Well, no, they're actually they're quite different. They have 18 foot ceilings in them. Whoa. Right, and uh, they're 1,450 square feet, so it's a home. It's big. Now, how many square feet was the one bedroom? 720. We at? So they're literally twice Double. as big. Double. Yeah. Well, hey. Um, and with some of the things that you don't see, we do have, you know, closed gates that are locked uh, most of the time. Mm -hmm. They're open when I'm here. We do have security cameras to watch the facility just in case. And small things that uh, are nice to know, we have a water filtration system for an 80 room hotel so you can drink the tap water here. What's up there? That's our gymnasium and our terrace. We should go have a look at that. Well, let's do that. Oh, wow. So we have a full gymnasium. State of the art stuff. And a gymnasium with a view. So how would you like to sit in your life cycle here and stare at that view? It's all right. It's all right, yeah. It's more than all right. <laughs> it's beautiful. Look at over there. Those of you who don't live here, the purple is a hakaranda that's in blue. Our hakaranda trees. Yeah. And before those was the pink ones, the primavera. <laughs> and then the yellow ones come up next. And the hills, when the, when the rainy season starts, are emerald green. This is an amazing property. We think so. And not only are we getting the best weather in the world, a great facility at a great price, living here is easy. You, know, you apply to Mexican consulate for your visa to come down. One, two, three, you're done. Mexico yeah. wants us here. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a great it's a great system. Well, that's a great tour, Kevin. Um, question: Would you consider this to fall into the category of independent living, assisted living, um, nursing home? What if somebody gets sick here? What happens? Well, if they get sick and they need nursing care, they can hire nursing care to take care of them. Yeah. Um, but we only allow it for a, a short period of time. Right. So a month, you know, six weeks. If they're going to get better they can stay. Unfortunately, our bylaws do say if you get sick and you're not going to get better, you have to move to a facility that can take care of you. Yeah. So and there's plenty of those around as well. So this would be characterized as independent it's living. independent living, except yeah. we provide the two meals a day. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, I didn't ask you, how much are the two bedrooms back there? The two bedrooms are $2,600 a month. Still a deal. Still a deal. Thank you for the tour, Kevin. My pleasure.
Here's Kevin's business card if you'd like to contact him with more questions we didn't answer today. His phone number and email. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.